model view presenter isn't something that just cleans your code but it makes your your app testable mainly because it separates the Android logic with the Java logic you want your Android logic in the areas where you want to instrument tests and you want your Java lo logic separate so it doesn't crash your testing and you just want it clean I it makes it a lot cleaner with doing model, model view presenter because you don't want all your code in one activity you want your activities to be only things that manipulate the view so that's our first thing view in model view presenter so the view is only our our activity and anything that changes the appearance on the screen so we do a model view presenter is well we're we're only going to focus on the the view and the presenter in this video but we're going to do main model view presenter as a interface and we're going to do void view We're going to do void display toast message. And we're also going to learn about the presenter. Void uh, clicked toast button. So that's the uh, this toast message probably knows how that there's about the interfaces okay so what you do is you don't do anything to change your view without going through the presenter so what that does is, give me a second, is, well let's create our presenter first. So our presenter is going to instantiate from presenter interface. And whenever we click the button, we just call this, and we, manip and we point it to the view to display the toast message. So now we can manipulate click toast button with Maikido and we can call that method whenever we want to we want to test the button click without actually clicking the button or using espresso or anything like that, a instrumental test. So what we're going to do is we're going to do public presenter and we, we want to get the the view so we do View, view, view. Want to implement, implements the presenter. Okay, good. Now we make this click on this button. We want to call the presenter, because remember, we don't make any changes to the view, so our activity, without calling the presenter first. So we have to call the presenter. That's one rule, so let's create the presenter class. Use this. Let's make this a field. So what we're going to do is presenter. What are we doing? Clicked. We clicked the toast button. So now we jump over here, and now this is called. Now we just do view dot display toast message. And now it's all separated. Now we did display toast message on the view because that's changing the view appearance. It's displaying a toast message. We can't do that in presenter because the presenter isn't meant for that. The activity is meant to display appearances and, and display changes to the screen. It, it isn't meant 
to use it for math. It isn't meant to act as a database. The activity in the view is meant to just display appearances and views and changes to the screen. And that's it. So we're going to do toast message and you clicked me. Oops. So just to recap that the presenter points to the view and the view points to the presenter. Do it this way because we don't want any logic in the presenter. We don't want any I mean we don't want any logic in the activity or the view, which is this is this is the view because it's an activity. We don't want anything other than appearance changes anything like that and the presenter is pretty much a bridge to other things like we can have things like public void um, insert text into database for example and then we would call our API and push to the database insert a row to the database very simple and play it. And now we just click our button, toast message, and you clicked me. So that pretty much is we have our listener. We call it the presenter because we don't want to call this right here. It goes to the presenter, and the view goes to the view, display, display toast message. And that's it. It's very um, very clean because now you know exactly what this is doing. You just have to change the method in here. You don't have to try and find this and click listener and try and change that. All you have to do is change the presenter because you go in the, into the view um, interface. You can see that there's a method called display toast message, and you can you can manipulate that easily. Much easier for tests, much cleaner, highly recommend it, and there's still the model. And optionally, there is the interactor, and that will be the model will be in the next video.